the humble frog has been hiding a secret like most birds, mammals, and a handful of reptiles, has a patella. This newly discovered piece of the anatomy of amphibians is just a small drop of soft cartilage, so nothing extravagant, but the discovery could return to our best guess when the patella evolved. A small team of Argentine researchers was inspired by relatively recent discoveries of structures called sesamoids in species believed to lack bony coverings. Sesamoids are bone material embedded in connective tissue, such as tendons on a joint. The knee pads, in other words. They analyzed the skeletons of 20 species of frogs and found rudimentary structures that were not completely sesamoid, but were not like the surrounding connective tissue. The patella, or patella, comes in all shapes and sizes in different animals to accommodate slightly different forms of locomotion. Have you ever wondered why we do not have an elbow? Protecting a forward-facing joint could explain part of it, but bone protrusion could also provide some mechanical benefit to what is essentially a lever necessary to balance a fairly heavy load as quickly and efficiently as possible. Recently, researchers from the UK explored the purpose of the strange double patella that seems to be unique to ostriches. If amphibians like frogs and toads have a similar structure on their knees, it is possible that the patella evolved from something that the first land animals brought with them. 